Millions of Canadians helped raise millions of dollars today as part of the Bell Let's Talk campaign to raise awareness about mental health. Bell, which owns this network, is donating five cents for every text, social media post, mobile and long distance call. The grand total is still going up, but we can say with confidence it will be over six million dollars today. That national discussion is music to the ears of a rock star who suffered himself. CTV's medical specialist, Avis Favreau, has that story. He almost needs no introduction. Rock legend Alice Cooper, working on his new album. But Cooper has another important mission, to get more people talking about mental health. I, I really believe that everybody has a certain amount of mental disability. I think we're all born with certain, you know, phobias, with certain things that we're afraid to talk about, certain things that we want to keep that wall between me and you, and because I don't want you to know about that. You know? And the best remedy, he says, is doing the exact opposite, talking about it. In this interview with producer and friend Bob Ezrin, Cooper has himself been very open about his struggles. I drank every day and found out, didn't realize I was an alcoholic. You know, till much until I realized that the alcohol was not for fun anymore. It was medicine. I had one bout of depression, and it scared me so bad that I said I will never go to that place again. And what happened? It was, was just, I have no idea. It was just a trigger thing, and all of a sudden, for three days, I was just I couldn't find a bright side of anything. I was just in this place, and maybe it was God just saying, "I want to show you what depression is." Here, oh wow, this is horrible. Cooper now keeps his life busy with music, with his faith, and with philanthropy, promoting mental health in troubled teens using music. We wrote a song called Hey Stupid, and it was about teenage suicide. You know, hey stupid, what are you thinking? You got your whole life ahead of you. You know, that song in particular, I've gotten so many emails. That song saved my life. Boy, I was going to kill myself until I heard that song. And we get a ton of uh, emails and letters and things that say to people, you spoke for me. You expressed how I feel, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. So what we're trying to say here is, um, don't wait for us. If you feel a certain way, talk about it. Yeah. Express yourself. With these veteran music stars now trying to empower others to spread the messages of mental health. <laughs> Avis Favreau, CTV News, Nashville.